Welcome back to Dinar Guru. I'm Sophia, and I'm thrilled to have you with us today. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and drop your thoughts in the comments below. This week, all eyes are on Iraq as Prime Minister Sadani made a groundbreaking announcement. Stay tuned as we dive into what this means for the future of Iraq's economy and the dinar itself. Let's get started. Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sadani of Iraq made headlines by announcing plans to revalue the Iraqi dinar, a move that could have significant economic implications for the country. His statement marks a pivotal moment in Iraq's economic policy and highlights the administration's commitment to reforming the national currency. This article will explore the context of al Sadani's announcement, the potential impacts of revaluing the dinar, and the broader economic implications for Iraq. Background The Iraqi dinar and economic context The Iraqi dinar, Iraq's official currency, has faced significant challenges over the years. After the 2003 invasion and subsequent conflicts, Iraq's economy suffered from hyperinflation, corruption, and instability. The dinar's value has been relatively low compared to major currencies like the US dollar, partly due to economic mismanagement and the country's turbulent history. For decades, the Iraqi government has grappled with how to stabilize and strengthen the currency. The dinar has been subject to frequent fluctuations, which have impacted everyday transactions and long-term economic planning. The recent announcement by PM Sadani, therefore, is a noteworthy development in Iraq's ongoing efforts to stabilize and strengthen its economy. PM al Sadani's administration and economic goals Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sadani took office in October 2022, inheriting a complex set of economic challenges. His administration has been characterized by efforts to address corruption, improve public services, and stabilize the economy. The announcement regarding the dinar revaluation aligns with al Sadani's broader economic strategy, which includes several key objectives stabilizing the currency. One of al Sadani's primary goals is to stabilize the Iraqi dinar. A stable currency can help reduce inflation, improve investor confidence, and facilitate economic growth. Restoring economic confidence. By revaluing the dinar and removing zeros, Sadani aims to restore confidence in Iraq's currency. This could enhance both domestic and international perceptions of Iraq's economic stability. Economic reforms. The revaluation of the dinar is part of a larger set of economic reforms. Al Sadani's administration has been focused on tackling corruption, improving government efficiency, and diversifying the economy beyond oil dependency. Improving living standards. A stronger dinar could potentially improve the purchasing power of Iraqi citizens, which might lead to better living standards and economic conditions. The mechanics of currency revaluation Revaluing a currency involves adjusting its value relative to other currencies. This can be achieved through various methods, including redenomination. This process involves removing zeros from the currency. For example, if the Iraqi dinar were to be redenominated from 1,000 dinars to 1 dinar, this would simplify transactions and accounting. The goal is to make the currency more manageable and reflect its improved value. Fixed exchange rate adjustments. Another method could involve adjusting the fixed exchange rate at which the dinar is traded against other major currencies. This could be done gradually to avoid sudden economic shocks. Market-based adjustments. Allowing the currency to float and adjust based on market conditions could also be a strategy. However, this approach requires robust market mechanisms and can lead to volatility if not managed carefully. Potential impacts of revaluation The revaluation of the Iraqi dinar could have several significant impacts on the Iraqi economy. Economic stability. If managed properly, Revaluing the dinar could stabilize Iraq's economy by reducing inflation and restoring confidence in the currency. This stability could attract foreign investment and stimulate economic growth. Public perception. Removing zeros from the dinar might improve public perception of the currency. A stronger dinar could be seen as a sign of economic recovery and progress. Impact on prices. Revaluation could affect prices both domestically and internationally. While it might make imports cheaper, 
it could also lead to price adjustments in the domestic market. Balancing these effects will be crucial to avoid economic disruption. Debt and Fiscal Policy The impact on national debt and fiscal policy will need careful consideration. If the dinar's value increases, it could affect the cost of servicing foreign debt and alter fiscal dynamics. Banking Sector The banking sector might experience changes in transaction volumes and financial management processes. Revaluation could lead to increased stability in the banking system, but it may also require adjustments in banking practices and regulations. Challenges and considerations While the prospect of revaluing the dinar is promising, several challenges and considerations need to be addressed. Implementation risks. The process of revaluation involves significant planning and execution. There is a risk of mismanagement or unintended economic consequences if the process is not carefully managed. Public reaction. The public's reaction to currency changes can be unpredictable. Clear communication and education about the benefits and impacts of revaluation will be essential to gaining public support. Global economic conditions. External factors, such as global economic conditions and oil prices, could influence the effectiveness of revaluation. Iraq's economy is heavily reliant on oil exports, and fluctuations in global oil markets could affect the dinar's value. Political stability. The political environment in Iraq will play a crucial role in the success of the revaluation plan. Continued political stability and support for al-Sadani's administration will be important for achieving economic goals. The recent announcement by Prime Minister Mohammad Shia, Al Sadani about revaluing the Iraqi dinar represents a significant step in Iraq's economic reform agenda. While the goal of adding value to the dinar and removing zeros is ambitious, it reflects a commitment to addressing long standing economic challenges and improving financial stability. In the end, I will request my friends who are watching me let's be positive and patient because patience is the key to success. Please subscribe my channel and support me. You guys have a great day. Thank you.